Hi, everyone. My name is Jan Dudkovic, and I'm a professor of political science at the Pratt Institute. I'm really looking forward to giving a class on working towards a plant-based food system. So what will we cover in this class? Well, the first thing we're going to do is ask what a food system actually is. And I'm going to give you an introduction to food systems analysis that will allow us to understand the various social, political, and environmental factors that all tie together to create both the food system we have and also that determine the place of meat within that food system. Next, we're going to turn to the question of the impacts of a food system in which so much meat is consumed and produced, looking at environmental impacts, impacts on labor, social impacts, and health impacts. We're then going to ask whether or not uh, we can continue producing meat and consuming meat at such a large scale to keep agricultural production within planetary limits. Now, the answer I'm going to offer is that we can't. And so in the third part of the course, we're going to turn to options for moving away from a predominantly meat-based food system, where we're going to look at questions of individual change, social change and norm change, the role institutions can play in driving a sort of shift away from a meat-based food system. And we're going to turn to alternative proteins or plant-based analogs for meat, dairy, milk, to ask the questions of both whether or not these are in fact environmentally preferable to uh, conventional animal-based products and what role they can play in a transition away from meat. Finally, we're going to turn to questions of policy, what policies are available to usher in the shift towards a more sustainable food system. And we're going to ask some questions about what that food system could look like in terms of whether or not it would just reproduce many parts of the conventional food system, whether or not we could think about a plant-based food system that's also rooted in more alternative and small scale forms of production, such as regenerative and agroecological principles. So these are some of the questions that this course is going to address. And I really look forward to giving it, and I really hope you'll join me. Thank you.